Hey guys, welcome to Sigma Chi. Let me show you around. This is our foyer. This is a place where brothers like to hang out. It's a warm welcome to our guests. We've got a couch, a couple chairs, and a bathroom on each side. This is our chapter library. Quiet place to do some studying. We got a printer. You can print out anything you need for class whenever you want. Memorabilia, awards, hundreds of literature on the Sigma Chi founding and its history. And this is also a cha our chapter's tribute to the seven founders and the seven ideals that they embody. What's up, boys? This is our mailroom. Any mail you receive from your family and friends will come right here, as well as any packages. Now we're gonna head downstairs. Traditionally one of our biggest hangout spots because it's the biggest room in the house. Here's our basement. Again, one of the biggest rooms in the house one of the greatest places to be at. It's where our social events and our parties happen. Over here on the wall, we have our coat of arms and our public motto, in hoax signo winkus. What's up, Leo? What's up? Here's the back patio. One of the greatest places to hang out with the bros. If you look over in the corner, we got a table, a space heater, a bunch of chairs, great place to hang out, basketball hoop, if you want to play basketball outside in the nice weather, you got it right here. Chairs, bench, place to study if you want to come outside, it's a nice day, all kinds of stuff. Here's our parking lot. Probably about 30 to 40 cars could fit here, and we're lucky enough to have one to ourselves. Here's a view of the house from the back. It's a thing of beauty, isn't it? Founded in 1880, and the building was done in 2002. Now, we're gonna head out to the kitchen, and you guys are gonna meet our lovely cooks. This is our kitchen. It's a great place for us to do our dishes, for us to eat, everything like that. Over here, our two lovely cooks are cooking up for our lunch right now. We have Yvonne and Ashley. They make, they make sure that we're fed every single day with delicious food for breakfast, lunch, and dinner, Monday through Friday. And occasionally they'll leave us a lot of food on the weekends, so we're not going hungry on the weekends. What's up, Casey? What up? Here's the night kitchen. We got a lot of stuff in the night kitchen, I'm not gonna lie. We got juice, we got coffee, we got tea, we got two microwaves, one new one. We got an air fryer, we got a little cooler right here to get some, sometimes she makes Powerade, lemonade, whatever it might be. We got a toaster, an oven, our ice machine. It's all here. Here's our salad bar. Today we got a bunch of fruit, um, a few vegetables over here as well. Um, and then we got our brunch. Sausage, biscuits and gravy, eggs, whatever we got, it's always looking good in these. Here's our dining room area. Typically, we'd all be eating here together, but due to COVID, we're kind of limited. So we only have about 10, 15 people out here at a time, uh, but we still eat out here occasionally. And then here we got the composite room. We got a few guys already playing in here, but we play euchre in here, we play cards, we play chess, we play piano, we study, we do whatever we want in here pretty much. We also have a projector and we can watch movies, watch games, watch fights, 
whatever you want, it's up there, so. For the final part of our tour, I'm gonna to be showing you guys the cold dorm. Cold dorm is traditionally where our freshmen sleep. It's a big room. Usually everyone can fit in there, but due to COVID, it's not happening this year. But hopefully, by next semester, we'll be back on track. Another thing to note, communal bathroom and communal shower on both the second and third floors. So you will always have access to a bathroom on every floor. Here's the cold dorm. As you can see, it's a very spacious room. Got enough room for a bunch of beds, all to be spaced apart following COVID guidelines. We have uh, armoires where you can keep your clothes, desks, you can fit a bunch of other stuff in here so you can do other stuff other than sleeping. But as you can see, not a bad look. Well, that's gonna do it for this tour. I hope you guys learned a little bit about our house, enjoyed the tour, and I'll see you guys later.